good morning my dear students in the chapter 7 integrals the exercise 7.5 so integrals of partial fractions so in the previous video in the discussed about okay any rational function how to split the partial fraction okay so you will method the three methods different different linear factor repeating linear factor irreducible quadratic factor the three concept video three concept based on the video the discussed about previous video now in this video the above concept based on the problems okay three problems so children if you watching the first time my channel video please to subscribe and click the bell icon for regular updates of my channel videos so now you will come to first the different linear factor the example of 3x plus 2 divided by is clear the first one here 3x plus 2 divided by x minus 1 into x minus 2 again x minus 3 is clear so x is equal to 1 x is equal to 2 and x is equal to 3 is a different linear factor is clear now how to find the same way how to introduce the constant a divided by x minus 1 plus b divided by x minus 2 plus c divided by x minus 3 is clear now what's the left hand side here 3x plus 2 divided by here x minus 1 and x minus 2 again x minus 3 is equal to is clear by dividing same way here and now I take in the LCM x minus 1 x minus 2 x minus 3 I take in LCM so here what's the value here x minus 1 x minus 2 and x minus 3 okay same value will come that's the LCM of this value okay so i find out what's the value of a a means x minus 1 so x minus 1 remove it what's the remaining x minus 2 okay into x minus 3 next b i will choose a b b value here x minus 2 so x minus 2 remove it what are remaining other two here x minus 1 into x minus 3 next plus c into x minus 3 should be remove it what's the remaining x minus 1 into x minus 2 that's clear so same way here denominator will same way that this value should be cancelled what's the here the remaining 3x plus 2 is equal to what's the value a into x minus 2 into x minus 3 plus b into x minus 1 again x minus 3 plus c into x minus 1 and again x minus 2 that's clear so what are the different linear factor x is equal to 2 and 3 1 is a different linear factor as clear so you could substitute the value of put okay substitute the value of put x is equal to 1 is clear what are the factor 1 2 3 is clear so first you substitute the factor value so put x is equal to 1 so you got to substitute over here 3 into 1 plus 2 so equal to what's the value here a into here put x is equal to 1 over here what's the value minus 1 again minus 2 is clear plus again put x is equal to 1 means here 1 minus 1 0 upon the here end value should be 0 plus again x is equal to 1 here also again the end value should be 0 what are your conclusions here 5 is equal to what's the meaning 2a what are your conclusions a is equal to 5 divided by 2 a is equal to 5 divided by 2 is clear same way here what's the another factor value x is equal to 2 up here put x is equal to 2 is clear x is equal to 2 suppose here x plus 2 will come means up put x is equal to minus 2 you will take it is clear opposite you will take it so up here x is equal to 2 what's the here 3 plus 2 what's the meaning 6 plus 2 so equal to again x is equal to 2 so the ended value should be 0 plus again x is equal to 2 means up here plus b into 2 minus 1 is equal to 1 here minus 1 again x is equal to 2 that value under value should be 0 so what's the meaning here 8 is equal to minus b therefore what are your conclusions so the b is equal to minus 8 that's clear b is equal to minus 8 next value x is equal to 3 up here put x is put x is equal to 3 same way here you could apply here 3 into 3 for 9 9 here plus 2 that's clear 9 plus 2 again x is equal to 3 means here 3 minus 3 so 0 up here first value should be 0 plus again put x is equal to 3 means here complete b value is equal to 0 plus here c into here 3 up here what's the value 2 
3 minus 2 again that value is equal to 1. Over here 11 is equal to 2c. Over here c is equal to what's the meaning? 11 by 2. Let's clear c is equal to what's the value of c? c is equal to 11 divided by 2. Yes, clear. Understood, children. So now, about what are conclusions? Up here, 3x. Given problem is 3x plus 2 divided by here x minus 1 into x minus 2 again x minus 3. Yes, clear. Is equal to what's the value here? A value is equal to 5 by 2. Up here, 5 by 2 divided by x minus 1. Next, b value is equal to minus 8. Up here, minus 8 divided by x minus 2. Next value C is equal to 11 by 2 here divided by x minus 3. So, this is a rational functions. So, I convert the partial fractions. So, I convert the partial fractions. That's clear. So, this given the problem is different linear factor. So, in the different linear factor, another one shortcut method. This is a standard procedure. Another one shortcut method. What's the given problem? Here, what's the value? Here, 3x. Given the problem is 3x plus 2 divided by x minus 1 into x minus 2 again x minus 3. Is clear? x minus 1, x minus 2, x minus 3. So, I am using the sound cut method. What are the factors are here? a is equal to x minus 1. You okay? Again, b is equal to x minus 2. Again, c is equal to x minus 3. So, x is equal to 1 is a factor. So, first I will find out. Put x is equal to 1 straight away you could apply put x is equal to 1 that's clear put x is equal to 1 so put x is equal to 1 means here a is equal to x minus 1 that's clear so i find out the value x is equal to 1 means i find out the constant value a so by here i come to a so equal to straight away you could substitute the given problem okay what's the here 3 into x value is equal to 1 plus 2 that's clear divided by here x is equal to 1 is a factor. So, remove it this term. x minus 1 term should be remove it. What is the remaining term? You got to subject. But here 1 minus 2, again 1 minus 3. You got to simplify. Here 3 plus 5 divided by 2. That's clear. 5 divided by 2. That's clear. So, what is the meaning? So, here a by x minus 1 plus b by x minus 2 plus c by x minus 3. So, I find out the value of a. Up here, what is the meaning? x is equal to 1 is a factor. So, x is equal to 1, here x minus 1, that is meaning x is equal to 1. x is equal to 1, I go to substitute the given problem. That's clear. So, 3x plus 2 divided by x minus 1 and x minus 2, x minus 3. So, x is equal to 1 is a factor means here x minus 1 term should be removed it. And the remaining value you got to substitute. Straight away you find out the value of a, that is equal to 5 by 2. Next, again, x is equal to 2. Okay, that I need the b value. b value, what is the value factor? x is equal to 2. Up here put x is equal to 2. So I find out the value of p. So b is equal to here x is equal to 2 means up here 3 into 2 plus 2 divided by. So here x is equal to 2 means up here x minus 2 term just to remove it. Remaining 2 term you got to substitute. So what is the meaning here 2 minus 1. Next again 2 minus 3. You got to simplify here 6 plus 2 8 okay, here formula that the value is equal to minus 8. Here denominator will come minus 1, so you will get the minus 8. So B value will come. Next, again I find out the constant value C. So C is equal to X is equal to 3 is a factor. So here put X is equal to 3. So it will same way you apply. 3 into 3 plus 2. So X is equal to 3 means up here X is equal to 3 factor you got to remove it. The remaining two term you got to substitute. Here 3 minus 1 and 3 minus 2. You got to simplify 9 plus 2 11. Okay, divided by here 2 here. It is 11 by 2 will come. X equal to 3. So you see the value of A, B, C. The same value will come. So this shortcut method is applicable for only different linear factor method only. The remaining under is not possible. Remaining under this is standard procedure method. Is clear? So this shortcut method only applicable for different linear factor method only. It's a very important. So in this video, the discuss about the different linear factor, the question number, different linear factor concept based on the one problems. Is clear? So next video, you can watch the repeating linear factor and the irreducible quadratic factor and the two problems solving method. You can watch the next video.